Never have I been this excited to make a video. One of our channel viewers is randomly selected and they get to pick any model and I will paint it and post it to them just for fun. Welcome to a very special Flashing Badger painting video and the start of a cool new series that I've named VIP Commission, which is all about saying thank you to the channel supporters over the last couple of years. Now this intro could easily blow out, so instead let's dive straight in and I'll tell you a bit more about the project along the way. Our very first competition winner is Arjak, and the model that he has selected is a Space Marines captain in Terminator armor. Now, he wants him to be a Space Wolf, but serving in the Death Watch. Ooh, excellent choice. I reckon we can have some fun with this. I'm beginning with the new Terminator captain model that you have seen in the Leviathan box set, but he's now available for sale on his own. To make this model unique and stand out in Arjak's Death Watch army, let's add some different pieces. I have an alternate head, a decoration for the armor, a Space Wolf shoulder pad, and a sweet Space Wolf shield and Thunder Hammer. Remember to scale the size up on your STLs to match the new Terminator scale. Now Niels from Fiverr has come to the rescue again and printed these pieces for me in a variety of different sizes so I can pick the scale that best suits this model. If you don't own a high quality printer, no stress, I'll put his details below and you can consider reaching out to Niels. I want this captain to be painted in the black of the Death Watch but have these obvious Space Wolves parts that show his heritage. Because as the captain of this force, I'm happy for everything to be a bit over the top and provide Arjak with the scope to create a fun narrative backstory for him. I'll paint away and I'll tell you a little bit about the backstory of this video as we go. Flashing Badger Painting has a Discord and in there we post pics of what we're working on, encouraging one another and now we take part in painting competitions. These painting competitions are a little different to what you might be used to though. You don't need to be the best painter and you don't have to paint a certain model. You instead set yourself any challenge as big or small as you like and that you can tackle in a month. This is designed to help you clear out your pile of shame or try a new style or technique that may have otherwise been intimidating for you. Then we all throw our names into a hat and pick out a winner. That winner gets to name any model and tell me how to build and paint it and I'll post that bad boy across the globe to them. And how much does it cost? Well, nothing. Our Discord is made up of people in the hobby that are supportive of one another and have encouraged me with my dorky little videos. This is my way of saying thanks and a way for us to have some fun. I'll tell you a little later about how you can come and be a part of our Discord, but if you're interested in picking up this model or others just like it and begin or continue your painting journey, I'll add some links in the video description below on where you can buy them at the best price. I've never been a commission painter, but I figure if I'm going to be adding a model to an already existing army, then it's important to have the colors and the style match. I asked Arjak to send me some photos of his other Marines so I can attempt to match them and he's also sent me this paint recipe for the models. If you don't already do this, you should. Writing down the paints, mixes and ratios for your army comes in handy because as we all know, you can call an army completed but then two years later, fresh models drop for that faction and they must be included. This will help you keep them all uniform. Before I show you how this model turned out in a fancy reveal of sorts, I first want to show you each of our entrance painted models. Whilst you are looking at the heavy hitting artistic prowess of the Discord community, I'll tell you how you can come and be a part of it and also support the channel. I'd love for you to check out our Patreon if you're in a position to financially support the channel and become a part of the collective responsible for affording me the opportunity to make these videos. Either way though, I'll add a link to our Discord so that you can come and be a part of the community. Jump in and show off what you're working on, encourage others, and of course, join our next competition. Well done again to everyone that took part. 
But now, let's take a look at how Arjax Space Wolves Death Watch Terminator Captain turned out. So the time has come to send this bad boy across the globe and exterminate Xenos for Arjak. He's going to need some rations and supplies to make the long journey. Plus, because he's not really a surprise for Arjak, we're going to need some bonuses to make it interesting. Thank you so much for making it to the end of the video. And because you're awesome, I'll give you a sneak peek at some of the video ideas that I'm working on next. My blood angels are due for reinforcements, so they'll get some love. And what else? I'm working on another extravagant sci-fi diorama and I have an 80s cartoon hero that I think would look really cool in a set piece and repainted. And what's this? Information has just come in that we now have a Feb painting contest winner and they've selected for me to paint them So, I'd best get started on that. So let me know below in the comments which of those videos you would be most hyped to see and also let me know that if you win the next painting competition, what model I'd be building and painting for you. Thank you so much, I will see you then and I will see you in our Discord. Goodbye.